August 31, 1962, the Hartsville Red Foxes, led by Coach Billy Ziegler, defeated the Union Jello Jackets by a score of 20 to nothing in the first football game ever played at Kellytown Stadium. In the 50 years since that first win, we've compiled a winning percentage of close to 70 percent. The Hartsville football program has built a strong and proud tradition here at Kellytown Stadium. The one piece of the puzzle that's still lacking is a field house. We don't have a place for our Red Fox football team or for the visiting team or for the officials. The new facility that we're looking at for the field house is, is approximately $1 million. The people we're asking to get in behind the project is the same people who built the original Kellytown Stadium, which is the Hartsville Citizens. Uh, there's no doubt this is a community project. Uh, without the community, it won't get done and the community supports this program, this high school, and we have a very loyal following in all aspects of the Hartsville High School family. We have to be able to build this facility. This is not something where we can just snap our fingers. It's gonna be us. We're gonna to have to do some grassroots campaign. Our players would receive the opportunity to not miss days of practice because of the elements, because of the cold or the rain. So not only would it complete a, a great facility and, and look the part, it's very functional. It's our baseball team will use it. So not only are you giving a million dollars for the football team to use it, but our baseball program gets to use it. This project just puts another jewel in the, in the crown of this historic stadium. I remember coming out here, my dad played in one of the first games ever played at this stadium. I've seen it come from the concrete bleachers to the, the great stands and facilities that we have now, the new concession stand, the new bleachers, the new lighting. Our baseball field has been voted as one of the premier stadiums in South Carolina. This facility is very important for a lot of different reasons at Hartsville High School. Number one is we had a terrible situation this past year where we had a young man pass away and we needed privacy. We needed a spot that we could we could discuss this and, and go through our players' feelings and control the environment. And we were out here on the grass, wide open to the population and the public. It was no way to surround our kids and, and, and control the situation. Also, the rain. We've had four rain games in the last uh, three years where our team was sitting on a bus uh, for over an hour at a time. Uh, this past year, our first game ended at 1 o'clock in the morning. You know, don't build it for Jeff Calabrese or, or Tony Ganey or one of the coaches or Charlie Burry or build it for the kids. Our kids need this building. Our children of Hartsville need this building for protection, for areas of need. This is a Hartsville project. This is what we need to happen again in 2013 to make this field house a reality, to add the last piece of the puzzle so that Kellytown Stadium, uh, the physical facilities will be one uh, that we can be proud of for our players, our fans, uh, everybody who comes out here on Friday nights to be a part of Red Fox football.